Hi, everybody. Hi. <laughs> We're back for another week. Yeah. Quick disclaimer, and maybe you've noticed this, maybe you don't, because don't, we don't know necessarily the editing process once this goes through post. We've been trying to help the editors out with our filming. We're trying a bunch of different different techniques. I don't do on my end. <laughs> different recording techniques with like the, the Chiron at the bottom of the screen and our cameras and different things. So if you ever see any glitches or ever see any like hiccups on like, hey, things don't look right or things are weird, thank you for bearing with us. We are experimenting trying to make things more efficient so we can get more content to you faster and in better quality. So thank you for growing with us. Yeah, um, if you want to see, yeah, but like mistakes happen and unfortunately they're not always fixable, especially <laughs> in editing. But what's more fun is if you want to see us mess up live. Yeah! On Twitch. One of the main things that we're striving for is growing our Twitch communities. Mackenzie has been doing quite well. If you don't already follow her on Twitch, Twitch twitch.tv slash Sharvana. And uh, if you want to check out Pat, you go to twitch.tv slash after Pat and uh, check us both out. He's playing a whole bunch of Zelda. At this point, he might even be done with Zelda and be going to get a Zelda tattoo, so you should tell him what kind of tattoo he should get. Yeah. And I don't know what I'm doing, because I just play all kinds of different Yes, games. Mackenzie focuses on very decision-based, story-heavy games as her forte, at least at the time of our recording, has been going through Dragon Age and has also recently finished the entirety of the Batman Arkham games, all, all that series. So if you like story-driven decision-based stuff. And we all met us, uh, or we haven't met, but uh, we met all of our current Twitch friends in Circle through the Danganronpa series, which you've heard me reference a couple times throughout MHA now. But so if you like any of those kind of games, check us both out on Twitch. We would love it. Links are down there in the about section. Boop, 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 boop. Just give us a like, give us a follow. See what but you enough uh, shameless self-plugging. We're gonna jump into My Hero. Let's do it. Even if I have a lot to learn, I'll focus on what I can do right now! I mean, I know that was the smart play, but that's still gotta hurt. <laughs> Any broken or anything. <laughs> but not as bad as before! I can only imagine. A throw like that requires a lot of force. Did he focus all that power into one finger? Mr. Hell yeah, he did. You see, I'm still standing. This kid. Hey! Uh oh. Deku, you bastard! Tell me how you did that or you're dead! Yeah. It's a capture weapon made out of carbon fiber and a special metal alloy. Stand down. It'd be wise to avoid making me use my quirk so much. It gives me serious dry eye. Too bad! That power's amazing! <laughs> okay, that's all the drops earlier. Shota Aizawa! Mm -hmm. He can erase the quirk of anyone he looks at, but the effect ends when he blinks! You're wasting my time. Oh, Whoever's interesting. next can step up. Midoriya, <laughs> take this and go have the old lady fix you up. Things are going to be tougher tomorrow when your actual training begins. Make sure you're prepared. I managed to make it through the first day, but there was so much I completely failed at. I'm starting out at the bottom. I've still got a whole lot to learn. If I'm going to achieve my dream... 19 makes me so mad. Aizawa, that was a rotten move. Huh? All Might, so you were watching. No talk shows today? A rational deception. That's cute, but you're not exactly known for being lighthearted. I read your file. Last year, you expelled an entire class of freshman students. You have no problem Whoa. kicking students out. Anyone you deem unworthy. You were planning to send last place home. So that can only mean you see the same kind of potential in young Midoriya that I do. What is this about? It almost sounds like you've been in his corner the whole time. <laughs> Isn't it a little <laughs> early for you to be playing favorites? He doesn't have zero potential, I admit. If that were the case, I would have sent him straight home after class without hesitation. 
It's cruel to let a kid keep dreaming of something that will never come true. Hmm. In Bachelor? your own strange way, you're a kind man, Aizawa. I know that. But clearly, we are gonna have us a problem. I survived my first day at UA. Even if I kind of... I love it. <laughs> but you know what, All Might? At least I'm making some new friends. That's gotta be a good thing, right? Bridget! You don't have time to relax, Midoriya. Not yet. The real test begins tomorrow. No, oh, no. <laughs> Coming through the door like a hero! Whoa. I can't believe it's really all my... So he is a teacher. This year is gonna be totally awesome! Welcome to the most important class at UA High. Think of it as Heroing 101. Here you will learn the basics of being a pro. And what it means to fight in the name of good. Let's get into it! Today's lesson will pull no punches! Fight training! Real combat? But one of the keys of being a hero is... Looking good! These were designed for you based on your quirk registration forms and the request you sent in before school started. <laughs> Costumes. They say that clothes make the pros, young ladies and gentlemen, and behold, you are the proof! Oh yeah, slow-mo catwalk time. Heroes in training. Oh good, you're here. Congratulations! I'm so proud you got into UA. Is that a costume? I guess I might have jumped the gun a little bit. I brought you food earlier, but you dozed off, and I maybe happened to peek at your notebook. Seriously? Aw. To be honest with you. I've been feeling really terrible lately about something I said to you. I think you might have felt that I gave up on you a while back. But now look you at you. <laughs> you persevered and kept chasing your dream like a real champion. It's a gift from my mom. So of course it's what I'm gonna wear. Heal. This is it. My hero costume. Uh, hey, Deku. Uraraka, you like I it? love your costume. <laughs> Not too flashy, you know? <laughs> I should have been more specific about what I wanted. This bodysuit is skin tight. Not really my style. <laughs> I love this <laughs> school. <laughs> <laughs> ah. You're so obvious. Listen up. A script? The situation is this. The villains have hidden like a, a nuclear disc. missile somewhere in their hideout. The heroes must try to foil their plans. To do that, the good guys either have to catch the evildoers or recover the weapon. Likewise, the bad guys succeed if they protect their payload or capture the heroes. Sounds like a classic action movie setup. Time's limited, and we'll choose teams by drawing lots. Isn't there a better way? Think about it. Pros often have to team up with heroes from other agencies on the spot. So maybe that's the reason we're seeing that here. Yes, I see. Life is a random series of events. Excuse my rudeness. No sweat. Let's draw. Who okay, cares? Hey. Okay. A lot of heroes, but I don't know yet. Wow, Yay. what are the chances? We're a team. Oh my gosh! I have to make a good impression on her. I declare that the first teams to fight will be. Team A will be the heroes. Team D will be the villains. Everyone else can head to the monitoring room to watch. Yes, sir. Get set up. In five minutes, the good guys will be let loose and the battle will start. Yes, sir. Young Ida, young Bakugo. The key to being successful in this challenge is to embody villainy. Think from the perspective of an evildoer. Got it. If things go too far, I'll step in. Understood. <sighs> Why is it that you seem to be especially angry when it comes to me, Doria? Was he seriously just tricking me all these years? I'm gonna roast that damn nerd today! 
You think they expect us to memorize this building's floor plan? It's so big. You know, All Might's just as cool in person as he is on television. I'm glad he's not threatening us with some kind of punishment like Mr. Aizawa. We can relax. Ah, you're sweating through your costume. Uh, it's just because we're up against Kachan. Plus, there's Ida, too. We should be on our guard. Who knows? Oh, that's interesting. I thought the whole oh, thing was right. like a visor. Lapido. It's just the mouthpiece. He's piece. the one who's always making fun of you. And he's amazing. All into more popular than All Might himself and be the richest hero of all time. He can be a real pain, sure. But his strength and confidence and his ambition, not to mention his quirk, they're all so much greater than mine. But that just means I have to do better. I refuse to lose today. <sighs> so it's a fated yeah. battle between rivals. Oh, not that I'm trying to get you wrapped up in my fight or anything. Are you kidding? We're a team, right? Let's win this! <laughs> <laughs> All right! Let's begin the indoor combat training! Team A and Team D, your time starts now! Pay attention, kids. Think about what you would do. Young Midoriya, in this class you're just another student. I'll grade you as I would anyone else, without playing favorites. And just like that, we're in. Careful. There are a lot of blind spots. I still have basically no control over one for all. I can't risk using it. If I did, I'd probably end up killing someone. We'll just have to win with Uraraka's zero gravity, and whatever I can do without a quirk. I've got to use my head. I took a lot of notes on indoor battles and fighting in tight spaces. I can do this. <laughs> Uraraka, you okay? I'm fine, thanks. <gasps> Deku! It's just my mask. What's the matter, Deku? Afraid to stand up and fight me? I knew you'd come at me first, and figured you'd try to catch me by surprise! He almost got the jump on him! Sneak attack, Bakugo? What kind of man pulls cheap crap like that? It's a viable strategy. He's playing the part, acting like a true villain would. It didn't work! Midoriya dodged him! Look, there he goes! I won't hurt you so bad they'll have to stop the fight! Just close! Wow! Look at those moves! Impossible! How do he know? He's not that good! <laughs> he takes notes on everything! <laughs> Damn, Deku! I analyzed every amazing hero, even you. I wanted to learn everything I could about them. It was all in the notebook you burned and threw away. You can call me Deku, but I'm not the same helpless, defenseless kid anymore! You hear me? I've changed! From now on, Deku is the name of a hero! But you know what? Hell I like yeah. Deku. It could make a great hero name. Plus, I think it sounds kinda cute. Deku. If you keep on hurting him, then I'll stop you myself! You're shaking in your boots, you're so scared. Because <laughs> you wanna fight me anyway! That's why I hate you! <laughs> Thoughts on the episode? Lots of new characters, or at least like more, we haven't officially been introduced to a lot of them, but now it's like, cool, they're on teams. They are your classmates. You're going to be going up against them potentially. So like you said, there's going to be so many characters to learn, <laughs> but we'll see. I don't know who's going to necessarily survive or, you know, get, I can't imagine any of them will will die. I know they kind of alluded that, you know, it's like, oh, I'll be here to stop anything if it goes too far, as it said All Might, so hopefully that's the case. But I'm excited to start, because now we're going to start seeing, I think we finally hit the part of the show where we're really going to start seeing powers, like, being used a lot. So I'm really curious to see where everyone goes with it, because that's, I'm fascinated with, especially as we're learning the different limits and parts of the quirks like I really liked the idea of Eraserhead's power 
but now we know that it's only like until he blinks so it's like oh okay cool because like i love having the parameters of it because now it, it makes for interesting combinations and possibilities i'm glad you pointed that out <laughs> first of all apologies my my neighbor is practicing drums all of a sudden so if you hear that in the background that's what that is <laughs> but don't shoot. anyway do you have <laughs> any broad predictions about bakugo Theories, anything? I think a lot of, and this is just based off of previous, you know, other media and other stuff. So who's to say? But a lot of rivalries tend to, if not work out, to be where they are some level of friends. Like I don't know if they'll ever be like, hey, we're let's go get lunch together. Like, but I'm sure that they're gonna have to at least team up, you know, and, and have the classic, like, I hate you and you hate me, but we're both going to die if we don't do this. And it's so, like, I'm pretty sure that'll happen. But I don't know, like, again, just keep, just to keep going with the Harry Potter stuff, like, if, I, if I'm considering him the Draco, like, if he has kind of villain characteristics, like, could he be drawn to team bad guy i don't know like will they ever fight against each other across like an actual battle line i'm not sure i'm gonna go with no for now because they have they have been lifelong friends i do enjoy that they keep cutting back to when they were children because it shows like no they even though they don't get along like they still <laughs> uh well yeah li lifelong yeah I mean, I guess they have been rivals technically forever, but I also enjoy that we've been learning that despite his treatment of, or despite the treatment he's received from Bakugo, Deku still admires him. Like, he is like, he's better than me. His power is great. He, his confidence is great. His, like, he has a lot of stuff that in, in Deku's eyes are worthwhile. Like, if he just would channel him a little better, maybe, <laughs> so... I don't know. I feel like they can both, they both have aspects that could help enhance the other person. So I'm hoping that they can teach each other, <laughs> but yeah, I don't know. I don't, I don't think they'll ever be like friends, friends, but I think that they will have to team up to take on the bigger problems that they will encounter at some point. No spoilers for me. Final question. Who do you think is going to win this? There's oh, this 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 fight. The I don't know. I think I think Ida's really smart. I think this is where we're gonna see like Ida's brains, part of the, his his personality. So, as I, I think we've seen Deku win enough so far. Like he got into school. He stayed. He, when he thought he was gonna get expelled, he didn't. He learned how to control his power just enough that we need to start seeing some losses, just to keep it balanced out. And we haven't seen a whole lot of Ida's personality yet. So I think this is where, I don't know how much Bakugo will contribute to it, but I do think Bakugo and Ida are gonna win this fight. But I think I'm leaning on Ida being like the brainiac type. Like he's just like, oh, I figured it out. And this is what we're doing. Cause uh, yeah, I don't know. That's, that's my guess. <laughs> okay. We'll see you next time. In the meantime, next time. Thank you so much for fanning out with us. Fans out. Plus, Oh, 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 o